Hello, Fletcher Hills family, and welcome to the new season. We're going to take the next few minutes and talk about tryouts. At tryouts, we're measuring each player's ability to use the five tools of baseball. The first tool, the arm, the hose, the laser, cannon, the bazooka. The second tool is the glove. Here we let the players flash their leather in the outfield and the infield. The next tool is the legs. Speed is not a necessity in baseball, but if you've got the wheels, it's the only place where you'll be encouraged to steal. The fourth tool is the bat. Everyone loves to keep their elbow up, their head still, load their hand, squish the bug, and rip one up the middle. The fifth tool is also the bat. Hitting is broken into two parts. The first part is hitting for power. The jack, the deep ball, moonshot, touch em all, bomb, dinger, no doubter, four bagger, round tripper, out of towner, oppo, taco, the souvenir ball. But big swings can result in big misses. The whip, k burger, punch out, the dark one, going after the high cheese or swinging after the spicy sausage. It's not all about hitting for power. The other part of the bat can be used to hit for average or the ability to make contact. Slap hitters, small ballers, ping pongers, the excuse me swingers. These hitters will sacrifice power for average, doing all they can to put the ball in play. Occasionally, all five tools will show up in one player, like they do in Mike Trout. You don't need to be Mike Trout to put on a Fletcher Hills cap. You don't need all five tools. You only need one. And that's why we try out. To get everyone on the best team for their tool. T-ball is for first-year baseball players league age four to six years old. There's no need to try out for T-ball. You'll be placed on a team after registration. Rookies is a coach pitch division for league age five to six years old. If you're five or six years old, then there's no need to try out for rookies. Caps, minors, and majors are kid pitch divisions in varying degrees of difficulty. Caps is primarily league age seven and eight year olds, minors league age nine and tens, and majors league age 11 and 12 year olds. You've heard me use the term league age a lot. Let me explain. League age is determined by the Little League calendar. Your child may be older than you think. Let's say tryouts are on the second week of January. On that day, your child is seven years old. If their birthday falls between February and August, then they are trying out as an eight-year-old. If your child is born in the months of September through December, then your age at tryouts is the same as your league age. Okay, now that I've confused you with league age, you just have to remember this one rule. We try out by age group and play with our skill level. You see, within the different divisions, there is movement. Some league age seven-year-olds are at a rookie skill level and they will have the most fun playing rookie baseball. Some league age eights are at a minors level and will move up to play in the minors division. We try out by age group, but we are drafted by our skill level. In that sense, the 7-8 tryouts are trying out for rookies as well as caps. We are looking to place people where they will be the most successful. So remember, you're coming to tryouts to use the five tools of baseball. But don't forget that it's January. And in January, our tools aren't very sharp. Sure, there are those that played travel ball and fall ball, and they may have better timing and their throws might be more on target. But most of us haven't played baseball for a few months. So don't expect players to smoke all five pitches, field cleanly every ball that comes their way, and then put on a laser show with their arm. Don't apply unnecessary pressure to your player. Tryouts is pressure enough. Remind them that baseball has a rhythm to it. Even Mike Trout spends months in preseason getting his timing back. And during the season, he's lucky if he hits safely on base 30% of his at-bats. So come stretched out, 
glove oiled up and ready to see some bad pitches from our coaching staff. We're excited to get them ducks on the pond, flash some leather, rope a couple, and sneak a bleeder through the 5.5 hole. Welcome back to baseball. <laughs>